Alright, let's go ahead and get into uh, Promised Neverland. We left off on the last chapter. It was good, man. The last chapter we left off was good. Alright, let me see. Yo, dude looking in the hole. Damn demon looking in the hole. Like, what's going on? Where we at? Okay, go to 0632. The pursuers found me. The game of tag continues. Did the motherfucker like decode this shit? Damn. No, it, it, no, it's written perfectly clear. Damn, he found it. Damn. He shouldn't have said... Ray wasn't thinking. He shouldn't have said go to it. Because they already know the, 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 the location. He should have just said go to the location. Pursuers. That's what he should have said. Go there. You know what I'm saying? And that's what all she said. What's this? A message for comrades carved by 81194, surely. Okay, what's 0632? I don't know. I do not know. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. God. Damn. If you would have said, I know exactly what that is. Let's go get the... It would have been like, okay, they're fucked. Okay. However... This proves that, as we suspected, the others are alive. He said, let's get them. And no corpse were found. It, beg it beggars belie belief. It, it, it beggars belief, but it may... I have no clue. Did I say beggars? It beggars belief or beggars belief. But, but it may well be that all of them survived. All of them survived. Okay, I'll bet where, I'll bet where, just where. Okay, where could they be hiding in the forest like this one? You know where they hide, not playing, he don't know. Okay, be at ease, they won't find us down here. Um, it looks like these demons right here, for some reason, they look a little different than the other demons. But whether they, they're different or not, like these, the demons that they saw before do not look like these ones. But, okay, but let's just say they're the same ones. They're basically like vegans. I don't eat no humans. Nah, fuck that. I ain't eat no human. That's fucked up. Humans are smart beings. We can't do that. We can't fuck them up. That's fucked up. That's what I'm thinking that they're doing. Which is good. Because I know we eat sentient beings and whatnot. I cross the line at anything sapient. Meaning, even if I do eat meat. I'm not eating no human, and if a dolphin can talk and, and reason like we can and say, hey, I don't want to get, I'm not eating it. You know what I'm saying? If the thing is smart like us, I'm not eating it. Okay, I myself built this path by connecting tunnels left behind by dead vampire trees. Okay, so these are dead ones, so they're not going to get them. It's a true maze only I and, and uh, Musica can find the exit. I'd be, and she said, I'd be lost, actually. So, Musica, she can't find the exit. So, basically, the only one that, that knows way through them, through them, um, through them, uh, uh, by, uh, through those, uh, through that maze is, um, Homeboy. I forgot what his name was. What's his name? Don't matter. Okay. They from the plantations aren't very familiar with the forest. We can't. We can just stay in these uh, tunnels until we clear the area. Oh, so they can, they can get through the whole area without. Okay, okay. all right, okay, oh cool, all right. Now the dude said that that it was their. Um, check this out. The dude said that it was part of their religion to not to eat people, so they could be the vegans of the uh, demon world, or. Or, remember, half the world is demon world, right? It could be perhaps that they do eat people. But remember, they're farming people. And what you call them, the farm that they were on has the best, the best um, uh, 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 product. The, the kids that they produce at that farm are the best. So they could be from a different farm. And trying to take the product, take the cattle back to the um, to a different farm, to another farm, to their farm, and start farming them again. They don't want to eat them right then and there because they want to. They want to get a better yield from their crop. Okay, the world was cleaved into two. Okay, they got the the human world and the demon world, 
the, the uh, what's it, musical on the demon side, and um, what's his, what's the girl name? Um, uh, Emma on the human world, human side. I wonder if the I think the demons are aliens or something like that. I wonder if their planet got destroyed or something like that, and they had to come to Earth or something like that. Okay. Oh, look, water and and animals. I don't. I can't remember how they pronounce. Wow, you're already getting good with this. So he know. Okay, Musica, do you live with your friends in the forest? Not live. No, we're just passing through. We travel through various lands, never stopping anywhere. So they're nomads. Why? But how did he learn that whole thing? How did he learn that whole route if they don't live there? I don't know about live there, but if they don't go there often. So they, they do they travel through the same spots? Are they like Native Americans that travel through like in a circuit? Like we always hit this spot at some point in time. So we might come here every two, three years, but we always hit this spot. The dude said, why? And the guy said, why indeed? Start laughing and shit. Why is he snickering? I don't know if that's an evil laugh or whatever. Okay. A promise, a contract between humans and demons. Okay. Don is thinking about this shit. I don't know what's going on. One of Minerva's Morse code messages was the word promise, right? So that's what it was all about. So that he remembered that. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. But Sung, Sung Ju, that's his name. Sung Ju said we're on Earth, but not in the human world. What does that even mean? The world was split. What you mean what that mean? We know what that mean. The humans live on one side, demons live on the other side. Okay, so we were so we were so convinced that something happened 30 years ago to make the world this uh like this, but it's been this way for thousands for a thousand years. There's never been human human lands here, no human countries, no cities. Okay. So they well in their in that part of the world, yes. But there should be stuff in the other part of the world. Okay. One thousand years ago, they made a promise and split the world in two. The human world and the demon world. I wonder if um if Sung Ju and Musica both got uh human ancestry, like like some of the humans actually made it with some of the uh demons, because they, they got some human asset aspects to them. Okay. Some Jews said things like the pathway was shut was uh shut down was shut down, the door was closed. Sounds like there was a place that could pass that could go in go in the past but cannot anymore. Oh, they, they had a they had a route that was that was available at one point in time, but it's not there no more. Okay, if that's true, we live in the world promised to the demons and we've been cut apart. Okay. We thought we lived in the world we we read about in our books, but turns out we're in another place altogether, right? We already know that. Let's move on. Okay, that's why that's why our final goal is to escape from this world itself. And Minerva is someone who probably knows how to do that. That's uh that's what we uh that's what we think, yes. Okay. We'll find Minerva and ask him how to cross to the other world. Then we'll have two years to uh, make plans and get ready. We go back for Phil and the others and escape all together to the human world. <sighs> After that, I'm, I ain't looking at the human world. I'm not, I'm not looking at the demon world. I ain't. I forget the demon world even exists. Okay, that's why we're going to uh, B0632. 0632. You know what would be funny? If some people were, were getting on a plane, right, and they're getting ready to go on vacation, let's say to Florida, let's say that's in the human world, like um, like the, the Western Hemisphere is in the human world, and the Eastern Hemisphere is because it's ja Japanese, uh, manga. the Eastern Hemisphere is in the uh, demon world, right? What if they get on a plane to go on a trip, let's say to uh, Florida, and they get off, and they're getting on the plane, and the plane just keeps going. They're like, yo, wait, what the fuck is going on? Why are we, why are we all over the ocean? What the, what the hell is going 
They finally they shipped the people, they shipped the motherfuckers off to the demon world. Oh my god. You know they got a black market. You think humans don't go through that black market? You think these people you think that you think the demons don't run out of people sometimes on the on the, on those farms? You think sometimes there's not a plague or something like that that wipe the humans out? You think sometimes um people don't get sick, uh they got bad crop, like all oh, the people got too much inbreed and they don't need more humans? They got a black market. What do you think the black market is only for for iPods and shit? They shipping people over there through there. Okay, there is a place safe from demons. From the demons. Okay, there's hope after all. Okay, yeah. But I wonder if it will be that easy. Right. To start with, we, we said we cannot cross over. The paths were closed as part of the promise. And we and and we want uh, to get a good, uh, quite a good number of people through. Even if Minerva no, uh, knows some way, it it probably won't be simple. Okay, no one's saying it will. It will. Okay, uh, crossing between worlds is probably very difficult. Yes, and before even that, we still had to figure out how to survive in the demon's uh, world. They got a good idea how to survive in the human world, though, because they read the books. The books was about human world. Plus, on top of that, you got humans to help them. However, we now have a reason for uh, to hope. Can we hurry up and get to something? Okay, we escaped, right? We escaped, right, into more trouble, but it's not all dark. We found a way forward. Okay, cool. I'm not letting any of us die. We'll all live in peace to, uh, again, happy together. Now that we know what's our, now now that we know what's our goal, I'll do anything. Even if it seems impossible, I'll force it through. I don't care how hard or painful it it gets. Okay. Let's go everyone to a world without demons. Basically, let's go to a world without fuck niggas. Okay. Our first mission is to reach B0632 and meet with Minerva. By the way, Emma, do you mind if I ask you one little thing? It's something I've been itching to tell you since yesterday. Something about Sung Ju. Okay, if you're not feeling well, will you please tell her? Oh, because she knows she's sick. A guilty, yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I'm all right. <laughs> she trying, she trying to, uh, she's trying to fake it. Okay, got it. You can't just endure uh, the pain all alone until you pass out. You're forbidden. <laughs> to be honest, that's true. Because if you pass out, then how you gonna help us? Now I'm gonna push through. If you if you fucking died, then we all sunk. Okay, you never well actually they got Ray. Well no, wait, yeah, they got Ray. Okay, you never take care of yourself properly, Emma. And uh what's this about uh cutting your own ear? You didn't mention that in the plan. It's good that you're such a brave girl, but if you die, it's all over. Don't overdo it. Okay, exactly. She said, but she said, but 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 nothing. And but but nothing. You better stay alive. Okay, Emma's being scolded. Very good, Gilda. <laughs> you tell her. Ray like, yo, that's what you're supposed to do, because Emma's a fucking retard. Then we're gonna keep it real. Okay, um Ray too. Okay, Ray too. What he said, what? He said, Ray better not play around either. I heard you wanted to be the be the bait and fight that lizard demon alone. And challenge the farm demons to a run. Do you do you think that's just fine? It's not. So he getting scolded now too. I hope they hurry up and get to something interesting. Cause right now, like like what's going on right now was good for last chapter. Okay, you take your eyes off Ray for a second, and he's ready to get himself killed. What again, Ray? Okay, now wait, wait right there. I wasn't. In Ray's case, he had to do something. Oh, yeah, let's ask Sung Ju. His chance of surviving that situation was zero. <laughs> he said, yo, this motherfucker was getting ready to get killed. He said, trust me, Ray was going to get knocked off. See? <laughs> he said, see? You was going to get your ass killed. But he had to do it, though. Okay, I won't die. I won't die. So, blah, blah, blah. Come on. I was so worried. Who's holding him? Emma? Okay, yeah, Emma. I was so worried. You two care a lot about us, right? It's like that. This time, it's us. Uh, it's us who's uh, who's super worried about you. It's true. 
Don and Gilda were almost crying. If you need help, say it. If you're in pain, say it. Don't just try to do it all alone. We're brave too, you know. We'll find a way through anything. If you're in danger, think of your own safety first, please. No. If you're in danger, think of, think, think. Sometimes you got to think of yourself. Sometimes you got to think of them. Okay, we're asking you, please take care of yourselves. That part is true. Okay. We're very happy that you're going so far for our sake, but in the same way, you are, you too are our precious uh, family, you know. Please get to some. So please, I got it. Thank you. So, uh, sorry, everyone. Okay, so she's she gonna she she's agreeing with them. That doesn't necessarily mean she's gonna actually do it. Okay. Um, they walk through these trees. Okay, they're good kids. That they are. Okay, what's gonna really happen? She's speaking another language. Then why didn't you tell them? Right in their moment of peace, a shadow. Why didn't she said they're good people, so why didn't you tell them? They look like they part human. Some Jew and Musica look like they part human. But she said, why didn't you tell them? So I'm still thinking they must be on their side because she said they, they should have told them. If they were their enemies, then why would they want to tell them? Okay, what do you mean? The dangers these children face, if they try to break the promise, they'll make an enemy of, of humans. Not of demons, of humans. Yeah, but I have no idea. I have no need. They'll know soon enough. Besides, blank was their enemy from the very start. Oh, so they're not humans. Wait. No, wait. Wait a minute. Minerva? It could be Minerva. It could be the humans. The humans might have been their enemies anyway. Or it could be some big demon boss or something like that. Okay, and that's the end. Alright. Damn, I wish they would have showed more. They, did, they, they showed a lot of shit that we heard from the last chapter already. But anyway, go ahead and leave your comments, like the video, and subscribe because I can't eat. I'm broke, nigga. I'm broken. You got the power to change that. Change that. Check the links in the description box. Peace.